back with another video. So the other day I was out running this Kaiju on 4S and running the dog piss out of it. And uh, I mean, I was doing speed runs in the grass and this motor was scalding hot. So I looked up some videos, just like you're doing right now. And uh, Gus, Gus's custom creation, something like that. He, uh, he got this fan, this power hobby fan to fit on the Kaiju. I was a little bit concerned because see the two fans, I'm like, oh god, I don't have that many spot on my receiver. Well, it comes with splitter. So if you buy from the link below, it comes with a splitter for the two fans. Come on, focus, there you go. Two fans, they're pretty high powered fans, I've seen videos. Part number if you want it, but I will put a link to the exact one I got. Turbo high speed fans. Super awesome stickers. Let's get this put on this motor. All right, hopefully you can see everything good. Now let's see. I remember hearing or uh, watching his video and seeing him have to cut a notch. Really sucks. I want the Power Hobby logo to be on the outside, but who cares about logos? Okay, bottom on, top on. You know what? I can just get the screws started. Hopefully, it has enough give. And then I'll see what I need to trim. All right, let's do that. Wish me luck, I don't booger this thing up too much. Okay. There we go. Cut a little piece out. Should clear that screw now. Should clear it. That's going to be a pain in the ass putting a screw back in. Alright, let me get this on. Thread locker. All the screws are in. It looks beautiful. See the little notch. Probably need to get closer. See the little notch I had to cut, just like Gus said. I use uh, dikes here, so it kind of misshaped this. So I used the longer screw to draw it together with this bottom. There's a bottom, it's hard to see on the phone, I'm looking. All right, let's see how this fits. There we go. Okay, I got the uh, heat sink on, the little area cut out, just like Gus said, for the screw right here. Now I have a question, hopefully he watches this and he can answer, or someone, okay, this motor mount here, there's a little pin that it, it hooks onto down there, and then it goes onto this screw. How, why does this screw, let me get uh, something to point to. Why does this screw have to be there? How You were not able to adjust the, um, if you put a different pinion in, do you just take that out? If you put a different pinion, I see this. 
if I take loosen that and then loosen the nut, I can move this back and forth. And I guess maybe you don't use that then? I don't know. If anyone can answer that, I would greatly appreciate it. So next step is, before I put the fans on, I want to plug them in. I got the box open and see which way they're blowing. I want to make sure they blow down. Okay guys, moment of truth. On. Ready? Oh yeah. Oh, so powerful. So windy. Let's give it a little. I just have a little 3S on there. Okay. Didn't mess with the mesh. So I'm gonna tidy up this wiring and call it a day. That's how you do it. There's better videos, but you know what? I'm doing it. I'm gonna make a video. It's fun to do, fun to do, fun to watch. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. See ya.